Kenya, from our perspective, transcends mere geographical boundaries. It is not merely a piece of land straddling, straddling the equator, but a vibrant community of people. We aspire for global recognition, not solely based on our excep ex exceptional athletes, but as a nation characterized by astute professionals, passionate Democrats, and diligent global citizens. Kenya's ident identity extends beyond physical borders, encompassing the richness of its people and the contributions to the global community, including the United Kingdom. Prominent figures of Kenyan descent have made their mark in the United Kingdom, investing in real estate and other sectors. I will not talk about the political side of it. In the realm of sports, Victor Wanyama, a professional footballer, made a significant contribution to the UK football scene and has helped promote Kenya as a producer of world-class sporting talent. Similarly, cultural diplomacy is a key component of our foreign policy as it fosters understanding, cooperation, and mutual respect between nations. Kenyan-born artist Michael Armitage has gained international fame exploring social issues in East Africa. His exhibitions in the UK have enriched this country, country's art scene with awareness of issues affecting Kenya and the wider Africa region. Madam Chairperson, ladies and gentlemen, as Kenya approaches the momentous occasion of celebrating 60 years of independence, we share at the intersection of a rich history marked by both triumphs and challenges. We stand as a shining beacon on the African continent. Our unwavering commitment to democratic principles has not only endured the test of time, but has manifested in the successful transition of power through democratic processes over several decades. This commitment, deeply rooted in the sacrifices of our valiant forefathers who fought for independence, remains a source of national pride. Looking forward, the core of our vision is a resolute focus on economic transformation through the grassroots upward. Beyond the formulation of policies, we are cultivating a legacy of limitless growth and shared prosperity under the bottom-up economic transformation agenda. In driving this vision, our foreign policy is holistic, grounded in our commitment to peace, economic cooperation, cultural diplomacy, and sustainable development. We remain steadfast in our commitment to these principles, confident that they will guide us towards a more peaceful, prosperous, and sustainable world. I look forward to a world where peace, economic connectivity, and sustainable development are not just aspirational goals, but tangible realities. Let us therefore strive to weave a tapestry that celebrates our collective strength and diversity, a world where every thread contributes to a more vibrant, resilient, and interconnected global community. Kenya supports regional economic integration through the African Continental Free Trade Area. At full implementation, this will create the largest free trade area in the world. It will connect 1.3 billion people across 55 countries with a combined gross domestic product valued at 3.4 trillion US dollars and with the potential to lift it, to lift 30 million people out of extreme poverty. Our commitment to the Africa Free Continental Trade is in, embroidered in a visa-free entry policy for all Africans. It is in this spirit of continental unity that His Excellency President William Ruto proposed a visa-free Africa 
tearing down barriers imposed by hands that were not African. We reject the limitations of the past, advocating for a continent where Africans trade, communicate, and explore freely. 